What's going on, my swillies? All right, so we got some more food, my friends. It's that time once again. Yes. All right, so if you guys have read that title, you guys had read that or looked at the thumbnail, you know, you know that we went, we went to thumb, uh, Char Hut. All right, so highly recommended place. Decided to try it out. So here we go. All right, so what we got was the char chicken and some frings. All right, and looking at the good old receipt here. Both of those two items come up to $14.98, $1.05 in my tax. So brought it up all the way to $16.03 for all of you guys that wants to know how much everything is costing. All right, so this is my good old bag. Let's open this, open this up. You guys might hear some rain. It is raining here in nice, sunny Florida. And it's also sunny, too. It's raining on this side, and it's a little bit sunny on that side over there. A little bit. Not much. Just a little bit. All right, so this is what they come in. All right, so this is the sandwich, and this is the, I guess, the frings. And, of course, they didn't give me any any condiments or any napkins or anything like that. My God. How dare they? All right, so let's go ahead and open this bad boy. Let's see what we got going on right here with these frings. I was told that I need to go get some frings. Oh, that's not the frings. Oh, it's the sandwich. The poppy seeds. All right, we got poppy seeds right there. The rain kind of left a little bit, which is great. It's great. All right, so that's that. Let's go ahead and unbox this chicken sandwich. Oh, my God, this thing done got nothing on it. What is this? They put nothing on my stuff, man. They didn't give me any condiments. My God, what is this nonsense? It's just straight chicken and bun. But that's okay. That's okay. They're going to get a nice little review just because of that. I'm going to give this a sniff test. It smells legit. It's all good. I, I want to try these frings out, though, because I was told that I need to get some frings. They got them wrapped with some foil, which I highly appreciate. So that means they're going to be good, nice uh, temperature there, supposedly. All right. So open up the foil. Fries and onion rings. Oh, it's both. I thought that was like all in one or something like that. Something together. That's what the onion ring part looks like. Kind of stringly dingly. So there's a sniff taste as well. It smells legit. But well, guys, I got no ketchup. I don't know what it is about service. Well, I have to actually ask for ketchup. But I didn't go there. I ordered it. This is the patates. Anyway, it's not bad. It's just regular stuff. It's not like gourmet things or anything like that. But that's what the onion ring is looking like, guys. That's what they're hitting on right now. That's it. Let's try this little dry chicken sandwich out, man. This is a dry mess. I don't know how they dare. How dare they do the swill like this, man? How? Char hut. Now, got the poppy seed bun, which was uh, was recommended to me. It's raining again. It's very soft. And we got the little chicken, little chicken morsels here. Let's go ahead and tear a piece off. Not sure if it's real chicken or laboratory chicken or anything like that. Not really sure. Honestly, this is the kind of chicken you'll put on a salad or something. Let's go ahead and get the bite of the light here, guys. I'm going in here optimistic and everything like that. Let's check it out. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. It's nothing to write wrong about. It's nothing to, you know, say, hey, mom, guess what? Guess what I had today? Nah, it's not that great. Now, I mean, I would, I would expect they already to have that, some lettuce on it already. I shouldn't have to say, hey, put this on there. I'm, I think I'm going to have to actually go there in person next time. I'm going to try it again now, guys. Got to try them one more time. But right now, like I said before, I was saying it looks like it's a piece of chicken that you put on a salad. It tastes like that, too. But since we have no kind of condiments or anything like that to put on this dry chicken, and it is pretty dry. It's not nasty. It's just dry. We're going to put some onion rings on here, give some flavor, and put some, some fries on here, guys. We're going to put some love on here. We're going to hook them up. We're going to do something that they should have done. It's all good, though. It's all good. It's all good. Man, these onion rings are strange. I've never seen onion rings like this before. It's different. It's different. I like different. All right, so there we go. 
gonna be i'm sure it's gonna be a 87 percent improvement Hmm. Yeah. Actually, 88%. 88% improvement. Not bad. It's not great, guys. It's dry as I don't know what. It needs some lettuce. It needs some kind of dressing. It needs some ketchup. It needs something, man. It needs a prayer. Got my mayo key cup. So you guys don't have one of these guys. Highly recommend you get your one. Hmm. Not bad though. It's not terrible. It's just dry. Dry. I kind of like these onion rings though. Not gonna lie. This is different. I like the. It's like the, the onions on inside. It's like they took the onion, they gutted the onion out. But they're there. And the fries, you're okay. I'm not gonna dog char hard out too bad, but you're definitely not gonna get a <clears throat> you're not getting that. Not really. Now, the chicken sandwich the way it is by itself, like this, on a scale of zero to ten. This is the way it is right now, guys. I'm not saying this is like this all the time. If I had the condiments on it. Right now, it's gonna get it like a straight four. Or a five, maybe a five. I'll be, I'll be generous and give him a five. Really worth a four. I'll be nice and give him a five. No, you know what? No, four. Four and head back out the door. Yeah, that's the mood. That's the kind of mood I'm in right now with that. What? I'm gonna tell you right now, Swillies, you can't win them all. Sometimes you get the good food, sometimes you get the bad food, and sometimes you get stuff in between. Whatever. Just wipe it up with the toilet paper. Throw it back in the toilet. And that's pretty much it, man. But I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna finish this off the best I can, the best of my ability. I do what I can do. But you know, only thing you guys can do for my myself is if you guys enjoyed today's video, which I hope you guys did enjoy it, make sure you guys drop that like. Don't forget to subscribe and tell a friend to tell a friend and tell some more friends about the channel. And don't forget to tell your enemies too. Because everybody needs to know. No matter how much you don't like them. Just let them know, hey, Swill, Swill Eats is uh, definitely looking for some more subscribers and some more some more likes. But don't forget to also watch those videos at YouTube or wherever platform you guys are watching. If they recommended some videos for you to watch next, make sure you watch those next. And I'll see you guys next time. We out!